Drum, Philly film. Drum, games. Drum. It's over. Welcome back to Philly film mauling. Yeah. Off off screen, Eric just got his face ripped off by a dog. What are you? Are you something good? God no. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is the? Is Red Gem just a useless thing like everything it, else? Or? Uh, it's one of those parts of a different treasure. Hmm. Please don't tell me he's bald. Oh. Yes, he is. Give me some room to work here. Da -da 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 -da. Charge! I'm dead. There's a yellow one in here. I want it. <laughs> yellow one? One of the herbs. Oh, the herbs. Okay. Yeah. I was going to say, I thought I saw something shiny, but I wasn't sure what it was. Because I'm... Can't keep track of everything. And I'm back out here again. Shit. I need to get up to that fountain. <laughs> yeah, that's. And I keep like running right by where I'm supposed to go to get there. I think. Well, let's just go. Here we go. No, you got it. Yes, you do. You've got the moonstone right half. Can you? Keys and treasures. With your powers combined, I am a complete moonstone! Uh, run away! Run away! Run away! Open, damn it. Let me go! I wanna go home! I'm tired of hanging out in Spain! All we talk about is football. I'm tired of it. They don't even pass like they do. They don't even have quarterbacks. This isn't football! Where's the quarterback? Yeah. What are you doing? Pick up the ball! Yeah. Pick it up and throw it, you son of a bitch! And cutscene. Oh, hi. Put your hands where I can see them. Uh, Sorry. how about on your boobies? Just isn't my style. Put them up now. <laughs> Ooh. Pretty. I ain't afraid to cut a woman. Bit of advice. Try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. <laughs> Leon. I'm sexy. Long time no see. Who are you? That's Ada Wong. So it is true. She's a big character from true. the Resident Evil series About in general. Mm-hmm. Where you, she you first wizard. shows up in the second game, I okay, see you've been doing your homework. and she's basically like Why this freelance What's agent. She does a bunch of stuff. Why she it's here? like massively questionable whether she's a hero or a huh? villain through all of the games, <laughs> because like here, she's working for the guy who see in the next man? game is the Ada. main villain, mm. who is also a villain in a lot of the games actually. Mm. But she's working for, like, a bunch of different people at different times and different stuff through all of the games. Oh. But yeah, she and Leon have, like, this weird thing where they potentially would end up together if, like, Leon wasn't such like, a goody two-shoes, basically. Uh, okay. Pottery! <laughs> Not anymore. Yeah. It's like all the pottery in your, all the precious stuff in your, your house. And your mom's like, don't do anything stupid around the next time you throw a football into it, because why not? <laughs> That's, oh yeah, the traders. I don't think I've ever done anything. I'm trying to think if I've ever done anything like that where I broke something of my parents. Uh, the only thing I really broke, and... Um, I, I, I mean, not even, like, well, I mean, I, I, I broke it, but I didn't, like, totally destroy it, uh, was this, wi this window that my, uh, at my mother's house, uh, what are you selling? I was, so apparently somebody had shot the window, you know, like, like with a BB, and you know how, like, when you do that, you get this nice little cone yep. in the, so I'm, like, nine, and I'm just playing with it because I'm, like, all, like, obsessed with it. Like, how did this happen? And, like, you can actually feel the air coming through and whatnot. Yep. And I must have pushed it too hard 
because like this huge crack just shot straight up through them. Like, oh my god! <laughs> like I had like a huge panic attack about it, and, and like I'm just freaking out, and like I started crying. I'm like, oh, my god. like it's my that's just my ass. Yeah, or I've. I've had situations like that where it's like something bad happens and you just instantly what start you bawling. Yeah, it's like, like you know, oh, the, like nobody's even yelled at you yet. It's mm-hmm. just as soon as it happens, <laughs> it just you start screaming. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had that happen once. My uh, my dad's shot because I was playing with a a ball and I was just kicking it around and it flew up and shattered a fluorescent uh-huh. tube light. Yeah, up there. Yeah. And him and his buddies are standing there, and I literally just like instantly started bawling. <laughs> yeah, I've I've had I'm trying to remember what other instances I've had like that where it's like, oh fuck, I am so dead. Yeah. Um. <laughs> like, oh. I, don't, I don't think I'm. Re- I mean, that's like the one that jumps out, but I'm trying to remember what other ones have done that because I I I mean. Well, the one that jumps into my head, but it really wasn't the same, was, it was a fight I ended up having with my father. Mm-hmm. Uh, my father, when I when I first got a job, uh, I had this, uh, we worked on, I got, I got a, um, I got a job at a place called Eaton Park, and I think I've told, said about this place, but it's, it's, it's a Pittsburgh version of Denny's. And, uh. One of the things he told me when I got my first job was, you know, uh, every paycheck put 10% of what you gross into your, uh, in your into a savings account. Mm-hmm. Okay, that makes sense. Never said why I should do it, just said that I should do it. And, uh, I, I mean, I, amount, I mounted a nice little savings account. And so, uh... There was a anime convention, Anime East '95 in Somerset, New Jersey, <laughs> and I wanted to go. And uh, okay, oh, because you read those puzzle things, and okay, that I'm just gonna say what the fuck, but I was like, well, that's because I'm not paying attention. I'm talking about stupidity. Story time. Yeah, story time. I like story time. Um, so, uh, I wanted to go to this thing. My mother didn't want me to really go, but she decided she would she would take me, and then she would go do something else, but she would drop me off where the convention was. Mm-hmm. So, I took out money from my savings account to go do this. And this is back in the day when uh, we didn't... Yeah, this looks bad. Yeah, it's actually a lot worse. Remember that guy? Oh, shit. He's in the cage with me. <laughs> oh, even better. That's okay, because there's a way around that. Oh, shit. Did it open? Yes, okay. Oh, that's... Yes, that's quite handy. Um, This is back in the day before you had electronic statements... Mm-hmm. And so you kept everything on a, on a, on a, in a hand, in a little book ledger yep. of like all your transactions and whatnot. And I kept, and I would always keep that in my, my glove compartment in my truck. Well, apparently my dad was, he, he was cleaning his truck and he decided he'd clean mine too. And he, he looked in it and saw that, you know, a chunk of money was missing. And, uh. He's smart enough to come in here. Ooh, yeah, that's a good question. Well, the thing is, is not like the easiest way to beat this thing is to actually just get him trapped in the cage. Uh huh. Oh shit! Yeah, this looks a little trepidatious. Big word for the day. Yeah. Um. Thanks for getting that zit. But he he had seen that I had taken out a nice chunk of money for this convention. Mm-hmm. 
and it became like I'm like and, and he and the way it was set up was he had uh, oh damn huh, that's good you can kick their head off like a rotten watermelon yeah it comes down to it <laughs> he uh he just he found it and he put it out on the kitchen table and mm -hmm. as soon as I saw him I'm like oh fuck oh, <laughs> like I know no. I know what this is gonna be about <laughs> yeah and it's just like god damn it I just you know I was. I mean, I didn't, I took out a nice chunk of money, but it wasn't like, you know, everything, but he was like flipping the fuck out about it, and I was just like, come on, man, I'm fucking 16, I'm just, what the fuck, and yeah, that was like a huge, ugly fight, and then he basically told me that from now on, 25% of everything that I grossed was going back into the bank account to fucking say, I'm like, Jesus Christ, man. I was gonna say, I don't think he feels that. No, I was just testing to see if, like, it would actually punch through him. Oh, okay. Ow. Oh, shit. It's not, not looking good for the brother. I just hate dealing with this specific part because you have... You know, Wolverine over there. Yeah, that's a problem. Especially when he comes right at you. Or did he get stuck? Not for long. Oh, so he can't get his shit stuck in the wall. Yep. And that's like one of your best opportunities to shoot him because that thing on his back is the only way to actually hurt the guy. Right. It just sucks because you're in a square room. He's too big to walk around. Right. There is an easy way to kill them, but I'm trying to save the grenades that I have. Right. Although I do have a lot of these fire ones. It's just the fire ones... will kill them. But there's a part where you have to face, like, two or three of those guys at once. Yeah. And I like to have them. Uh, that's understandable. He ran. Mommy! The man put me on fire! Well, hi. Oh, who are you? Okay. Where, where, where's the big guy? What'd you do with him? You see your big brother? I'm looking for him. It's kind of important I talk to him. Did he die? If he did, he didn't leave anything behind, which would suck for him being such a big ass to kill. Yeah. Save some ammo here. Oh shit! Oh, he's one of the spider ones. Crap! I don't recall this. I don't recall the spider ones. Oh no, he's oh, back. He's yeah, he's still out here somewhere. Where did he go? Though? He's right behind you. Oh, there he is. Yeah, I I picked that up. Just don't want to deal with this thing. It's just because the worst part is, is that little spider you think is going to break off. off. Yeah. Oh, he's just not having your sass either. No. Yeah, it's... Looks like he's trying to knit something, but he just can't do any, yeah. anything about it. Oh, fuck. You are. You are definitely getting jacked up. There he is. Well, if he would just stay turned around. You would definitely put a bullet in his back. I'd finish it off dealing with him. Oh, fuck. Oh, hell. It's like, which do you take now? Yeah, it's like whichever one I'll survive the hit from, at least. I was going to say, yeah, now you have to look out whenever you shoot something because... Son of a bitch might just come right down the hallway and fuck you up. Yeah, because Wolverine over there doesn't like noise. I mean, I understand completely. That's why I have sound-canceling headphones and whatnot. Oh, yeah, I got that. It's just, I don't, you know, kill people over there. <laughs> I'm, why not? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of effort. Oh, fuck you. 
<laughs> Jesus. Even Eric's getting frustrated at this oh, point. It's like, like, God you... damn. Well, because not only do those ones break off and attack you, they spit at you. Right. And he's still... Still walking around. Mr. Juggernaut over there. Yeah, this is... This, this is getting to be... Oh, oh damn. Man. Oh, fuck. This is turning into quite the war of attrition now. It's just like, where the fuck do I go? What the fuck do I do? Oh, shit! And I think I might be dead right here just because that bug's right there. Damn. I was gonna say, oh, oh, oh! Oh, it hurt. It's not dead. But okay, but the other one's gone. So, for now, yeah. Those until... guys keep spawning until you kill them. Him. Yeah. To... Oh god. What is he doing? He's just like rotating now. If you want, he's just... sitting and spinning. That's what he's doing. Yeah, sit and spin on it, buddy. Okay. Oh, please give me a shot. Yes. <laughs> Did you get him? Oh, he's dead. Hot damn! <laughs> Next time on Philly Film Games! Oh, thank God! 